I remember listening to your show when you were on radio, oh. and you said you were a big sister. I was. And I, back then, I'm old, um, I, they were called volunteers, and I had a very influential volunteer, this woman, um, that helped me understand as well that I can obtain other things. She took me from the home That's on the big. weekend, sometimes when I couldn't go to Brooklyn, yes. to her house. And I said, oh, this is how other people live? Yes, yes, you know, yes. This, this is a possibility? Yeah. And as an adult, when I heard you on the radio and you said that, it touched me. Thank you, Rosie. You know, really Thank did. you, thank you, Rosie. Um, a shout out to the Big Brothers and Big Sisters organizations, yes. or if you happen to be an older person, you don't have to necessarily formally be involved with them, but it's That's nice right. to reach back and, and thank you, Rosie. Um, now, about this thing with you and Tupac, because oh. while I was on the radio, I do remember stirring that pot as well. <laughs> <laughs> All right, oh. explain this picture and, and where you were and why it was that we were all talking about Rosie and Tupac being a couple. Right, everyone thought that we were having sex. Yes! Yes, and, um, and we weren't. Oh! <laughs> what happened was is that I was supposed to go to the Soul Train Music Awards with this other guy in the music industry. Don't ask, we'll talk about it afterwards. Okay. And, um, <laughs> and he stood me up. Oh. He stood me up 15 minutes before we were supposed to leave. And Tupac, we were friends, mm. and he called me up and he was like, what's up? And I was like, <laughs> and he said, yo, forget that. Right, okay? right. And he says, let's go up there, I'll be your date. I said, what? He goes, he's gonna be so jealous with, with, uh, with me and you and, wow. and everything. I said, yeah. And he goes, plus I want you to hook me up with Madonna. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now, did you, did you, now I'm sure you don't do this now, but back then, did you puff a little law before you hit the red carpet? Okay, okay. <laughs> um, oh, that was 20 years ago. That was 20 years but, ago. But, but what happened was is that I really, I, I wasn't a puffer back then. Oh, oh, so it hit you good. Oh, what? Oh, what? <laughs> okay. <laughs> to the point where we were in the limousine and my best friend Julie was, um, in the limousine as well. Yes. And, and we're sitting there and, <laughs> and we're like, whatever, whatever. And, and I look at Pac and he looks at me and I go, are we supposed to kiss or something? <laughs> and, and he said, no, because you're the type of girl that someone marries. Oh, so, so did, did he end up leaving with Madonna or hooking up with Madonna? Oh, well, we learned something new every day. Wow. Yeah, and, and, and it was crazy night because when we got out of the limo, I was so stoned and, <laughs> and I was so scared and, and everything. And, and he's like, don't worry, I got you. And that's the handing, the whole the that's hand. That's the picture? That's the picture when he said, I got you. Aww. It was so cute. And then when we got there and we sat there, I didn't realize he was sleeping with half of the women in the industry. <laughs> More great chat with Rosie after these messages. Rosie's still here. You know, Rosie's first big break was um, Soul Train, and we have the video. Let's oh God. See, see you, see how you did it. Oh. Oh, 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 look at that. I love this. Rosie, you oh are doing the most. Oh my God, what? Okay. What? Oh. Okay. Oh. 